Hey boys, we're on the way to the mobile vet right now to get this guy neutered and each of them the rabies shots. So, I guess, oh, where? The seatbelt is partially failing. Partially not. He loosened up the seatbelt thingy that was locked. What are you doing, boy? So he's gonna get neutered. He is five months old today, I believe. We both of you guys. These massive puppies. And Alithia will be getting the spade next month. She was supposed to do it today, but we decided to push it a month. Right, Lakis? He really shouldn't be able to reach the floor right now. I know you're angry, you're angry. No comment. Huh? No comment. Ah. Uh, so Lakis just got neutered. We had to take his cone off for the car ride because he was freaking out, but he's still freaking out, so I'm holding him in the back seat. <laughs> This boy just got neutered and we picked him up like 10 minutes ago? 15. 15 minutes ago. And yeah, apparently he's really bad with pain. They have to give him an extra dose of painkillers. Olivia, come on guys. I know you guys want to play. So um, yeah, this is like his post neuter. Alright, so they just finished eating and now they're drinking. We were told to give them half, well, give him half the amount of food. And since we feed them together, we just gave them half in general. And I'm going to put them out. I'll put his cone on, take off his harness, and then lock them up in their crates for, like, so they stay calm and stuff. Because they like tackling each other and all that stuff, which isn't good right now because he just got surgery. So I'll go and do that. So, as you can see, like, this is really upset. <laughs> but I can't let them run around because he'll tear open his stitches. So, my poor boy. My poor boy. I don't want to completely cover him up because I want to make sure that he doesn't get to his stitches in case he takes off his cone. So maybe I'll just half cover him. My poor babies. So, um, yeah, this is like it's right after his neuter. Um, I forgot to tell you, we dropped him off at... 8.30 and we picked him up at 9.30 so they got it done and we picked him up like right away um again like I said before <laughs> like is <laughs> alright so I took his cone off so they could eat and drink their dinner <laughs> it was a fail trying to get him to eat and drink with the cone on so I had to take it off um and yeah, I took a picture of his area type of thing. Um, I'll insert it right now. It's like, you'll see the stitches and stuff. Um, so yeah, I'll insert that right now. Look away if you're not comfortable with it. But, um, yeah, um, this is how Legacy's like, neuter went his first day home. He's doing really, really well. He hasn't thrown up or shown any nausea. He acts like himself. The only thing is he does kind of want to lick his stitches and stuff. I realized that when we were in the car. and But at the vet and in the car he was uneasy. But as soon as he got home he got back into the routine. So it's really important to let your dog go back into his routine. Just be careful and make sure that he doesn't play rough with the other dogs. For the, for the recommendation of days that your vet says. Our vet says seven days. The uh, online I looked it up and it says seven to ten days. So it honestly depends on your vet. Oh, he does it this time. Like it, come. Um, you love her, babe. You love the girl, dude. <laughs>
So this is, like it says, one week, so seven days post-op. And now he can have his cone off, the vet said. Um, I will show you guys his stitches area if he comes back and stays still. People will show the world your crotch stitches area. It's right there. Right there. Yeah. Yeah, you good boy. You good boy. You go go. So, I guess this is it, <laughs> Fish Ruby. Ah, stop kissing me! <laughs> um, thank you guys for watching.